and the substantive motion that there is no relationship between Let, let's go their arrest, the votons, Mr. Speaker, order, order members. That let's there is no relationship the between their arrest, Mr. Speaker, their, their Mr. Speaker, uh, 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 removal from the jurisdiction of this house and the voting in this house. If that is not true, if that is not true, Mr. Speaker, confirm to me that no other senator in this chamber will vote on behalf of Senator Malala if that was not the plan. Confirm to me that Senator Milko has not been aligned to vote on behalf of Senator uh, Langat, even though, Mr. Speaker, Senator Langat has written in no uncertain terms that no one else should vote on his behalf. Even though Malala has written that no one should vote on his behalf. If you confirm to me, Mr. Speaker, that that is not the position, I will know that the conspiracy we are talking about is not there. We are not children. I have been majority leader and deputy majority leader in this house for more than five years. The magic 24 number, we were 25 voting in this house last week. Mr. Speaker, the desire was to reduce us from 25 to 23. Transport, Mr. Speaker, the vote of Senator Langat, give it to Milko. Get, the, uh, Mr. Speaker, the vote of Senator Malala, give it to one of the members of his delegation, whether it's Yongo Msuruve, and Mr. Speaker, achieve the objective of defeating the will of the people. Mr. Speaker, you can't tell us we should just proceed. It is not possible. It is not possible, Mr. Speaker. This is Kenya. We cannot be forced, Mr. Speaker, to take positions of the minority. Mr. Speaker, you are sitting in that chair. Senator Malala was in the opposition. He was among the only few senators that voted to get you 42 votes, Mr. Speaker, to become in that chair. Senator Lalekwa and Senator Lalakad were among the 42 people who voted for you to be the speaker. Mr. Speaker, you sacrificed me. You sacrificed Susan Kiika. Don't sacrifice Kenya. Don't sacrifice, Mr. Order, Speaker. Order, 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 Senator Murukomen, you must order, order members. Senator Murukomen, I know we are discussing an important motion, but you should respect the speaker. I don't act as a person, I'm guided by the law, the standing orders and the constitution in this house. And the decisions I make are angered on those two. I will not allow that, I'll not allow this house to degenerate to that level. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I love the fact that you have restated your constitutional responsibility as the Speaker. But Mr. Speaker, a report has been brought to this house that the, 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 the minister is not available to come to these chambers. Soon, if, even before the, 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 the chair sat down, the CS Matiangi has updated Mr. Speaker that he was busy launching a border border information management system with the CS Musheru. The IG, Mr. Speaker, has posted that he was uh, launching a sanitation component towards better human environmental something with the CS Matiangi. Mr. Speaker, I respect your authority, but so others should respect your authority, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, if we force this house, and I'm just saying this without fear of any contradiction, if we force this house to punish 18 counties, El Gio Maracuete is not a losing county. Uh, Bomet, where Senator Langat has suffered, Mr. Speaker, is not a losing county. Mr. Speaker, Kagamega, where Malala comes from is not a losing county. We are just but honest patriots who want the best for this country. We are willing to suffer for the unity of this nation. We have come this far to make this decision, Mr. Speaker, because we want to make this country to be one. History will be kind to us. Mr. Speaker, now history, the determination of an historical moment shifts to your chair, Mr. Speaker. So that, Mr. Speaker, if this house will be used by those who are sitting out there to force a decision, Mr. Speaker, 
against the standing orders. You have, you have assured me that you will follow the Constitution, you will follow the standing orders, therefore you will respect the letter of Malala that no one will vote for him, you will respect Mr. Speaker the letter of, Bo of Bomet that no one will vote for him. Mr. Speaker, if you make the same mistake you made in my situation, on this order, very important order, issue. Order, order, Senator. Position order, of my order, majority Senator. leader is no, 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 nothing, no. Mr. Speaker. Senator Murkomen, order, order, order. Take your seat. Senator uh, Ekal. What's your point of order, Senator Bogisho? Mr. Speaker, if, if although now uh, Honorable Murkomen has, has left, but Mr. Speaker, some of the claims that he has made here needed to be withdrawn because it's an attack on the chair, Mr. Speaker. And I think, Mr. Speaker, we start, I started by saying if we allow some of these small dilatory uh, substances that come, Mr. Speaker, it will grow bigger and until people can now direct their eyes to the chair and almost themselves desecrate the chair. Mr. Speaker, can I just request, Mr. Speaker, that you take us back to where we belong, in the House of Order. Thank you. Senator Orengo. Also, Senator Orengo I'm, is I'm also rising on a, a little point. It is a constitutional and a matter of procedure. Uh, and Mr. Speaker, I'm getting worried about the clerks. Uh, because there are certain procedural issues that are making us now talk without conclusion. Uh, because at the beginning there was a report by the chairman of the security committee. That report was given